when I'm in these moments, when I'm experiencing RSD, when I'm noticing being really like critical of myself, really taking to heart what other people are saying or not doing or how I'm experiencing feedback, I've got to get out and move like creativity mm. and, and just being in movement and grounding myself, whether it be in nature or going for a walk or just getting out of this space. Because I think a lot of the times that RSD space, that energy, that actual physical presence of like feeling stuck and confined in it. Mm -hmm. If I can just put my phone down or my laptop in my house, leave the technology behind, go for a walk for an hour, go for like, just go do something else away from it. It really does allow me to center and ground and just regulate. Mm -hmm. I love that. I love that. Yeah. I often will like use the metaphor of like burning excess energy. And that's very much what it feels like when I have an RSD trigger. Like I just feel like so much energy. And so absolutely, if I can channel it towards something like a walk or something that's more grounding, that helps me move through that energy more. I'm still going to have the intrusive thoughts. I'm still going to have the rumination and I have other strategies for that, but the getting the, the kind of stress anxious energy out is, is, so important. 